Hey hey you guys, I am back with some Blood Rage miniatures, uh, this time the Blood Rage e Kickstarter exclusives, so these guys you could only get on the Kickstarter exclusive pretty much. Uh, so um, we played a game of Blood Rage uh, last weekend and it was really fun. Uh, so and it is it's I think it says on the box that it takes like one and a half hours or so. Uh and I thought that we would like maybe be finished in like three hours or so because it was the first time we played it, but we got finished in five hours somehow. I don't know really how, but that is the time it took for us to play in the game of Blood Rage, uh, which is kinda crazy. Um but it, it went fine and so on, I think, but yeah. Uh, so I don't know if we took uh, quite some time, everyone, on us to make our choices or whatever when we played, I don't know. But yeah, next time it will probably go faster. <laughs> okay, let's have a look at this, guys. Um, this is the Mountain Giant. I just... Uh, this, this mini is so cool. I think he's... Uh, you can see he has a shield strapped to his stomach. Uh, and the skulls and he he I just I like how human he looks like uh, that is what I really like about him uh, so he's just a huge human and he has a rune stone like uh, strapped to a stick or like a big ass wooden yeah stick part of a tree or whatever uh, it's like, I mean, he must have made it like completely out of tree because I don't know if there are branches that are that big. Yeah, maybe, but still, anyway. Um, he had some cool furs and hides on him and yeah, really muscly, cool dude. So, uh, really like the look of this guy. We'll probably, yeah, we'll probably enjoy to paint him. Um, we have the Mystic Troll, which is a different troll this time. Uh, a shaman-like troll, older guy, it looks like. He has spear tips like hanging from his uh, hair, it looks like, like um, ornaments or whatever. Or jewelry, he uses that probably. Big club, a backpack, you can see an arm sticking out there. Some cool leather and a staff, some cool details. He have quite some details on him. These guys will probably take some time to paint. Uh, and we have the Fenrir or the F or Fenris Ulven, as we call him. The wolf that is the son of Loki. That got uh, chained with invisible chains. It is uh, Fenrir that ate Tyr's hand, the god of war, pretty much. So, this guy is the reason why Tyr only had one hand, if you wonder. His chains are, although not invisible, I think, but. In uh, yeah, but he looks really cool. I, I really like the pose and uh, how threatening he looks like. Uh, really, really cool model. We'll enjoy to paint these guys, I think. So, quite big dudes. All right. Uh, so, that is that for this time, guys. Um, I will hopefully give you an update of something soon of these guys or something else. We'll see. Um, I haven't been in a painting mood lately, which is also bad. Um, I don't. I don't know what to say about that really, but uh, it's it's a bit strange that you just have these moments that you are. Not really feeling for painting anything or whatever, but what well, do you really like it? But I'm going to try to get going with these guys 
soon, so uh, I need to keep on painting because I have quite some stuff to paint um, and I really want to finish up the Blood Rage stuff, so what I have left on Blood Rage is Oh, I have quite some stuff actually left on Blood Rage. I have these guys, I have the gods, uh, and I actually have two more clans. Uh, I have painted up four clans already, but I have two more clans. So we'll see in what order I will do it. Uh, okay, anyways, uh, thank you guys for me now. I hope you liked the video and uh, have a good one.